Alert! John Kerry busted embezzling tax dollars for this sick purpose. How is it possible that the deep state secretaries of state, Hillary Clinton, and her successor, John Kerry, are still getting away with this kind of crime? More than $9 million of our taxpayers' dollars were moved through the State Department and into a nonprofit foundation headed by Vanessa Carey. That's John Kerry's daughter, via via the Daily Caller. First, this enormous sum was given to the Peace Corps. They awarded the money to Vanessa Carey's nonprofit, Seed Global Health, as a three-year contract. There was no competition for this contract, and Carrie's nonprofit was created with the program in mind. She obviously knew she was guaranteed the money. This type of corruption runs deep in our government and the State Department in particular, that no one even bothered to pretend there was a uh, competition for the money. Instead of bothering to seem unbiased, the Peace Corps went ahead and awarded Seed Global Health a second contract after the first was up. It was a four-year contract, this time worth $6.4 million of the State Department funds. This is just one way that the deep state takes our tax dollars and lines its own pockets. Yes, The group did some actual charity work with this money, but Vanessa Carey Carey still drew a salary from her nonprofit. In fact, she was paid her first salary in 2014. She was the only officer who received compensation. We have learned this from the nonprofit's 990 tax form. She supposedly worked 30 hours per week and made $140,000. John Kerry has apparently learned something from his predecessor, Hillary Clinton. Somehow the children of these politicians think they deserve to make a great living off our tax money. No longer do you secure a job for yourself when you become Secretary of State. Evidently, you secure jobs for your children, too. The Clintons were greedier about it. They put more money in their pockets and in Chelsea Clinton's wedding dress, apparently, than the Carey family stole, but make no mistake about it awarding your children government contracts without competition is nepotism. It's stealing. Don't let the fact this was a charity soften your hearts either. Competition exists to make sure whoever gets our money makes the best of it. I'm sure there are more efficient, experienced, or innovative nonprofits that could have made our money go further. Well, they made it go further right into their pocket. And uh, you can't put it past them. And, of course, you're trained through Hillary Clinton. I call this guy Lurch. Anyway, let us know what you think in the comments below. And, again, thank you so much for watching.